Hi guys, I want to tell you a manifestation that just happened to me. Well, it was yesterday when it happened. So this happens all the time and it's, an, it's truly amazing. So I'm driving and I say, universe, show me something cool. First, I want to tell you, I live in a small town in Alabama, like in the woods. This is like pickup trucks everywhere. Yeah. So it's like, okay, show me something cool. But first, I want to tell you that like two or three days before that, I was just looking at them because I was like, I wonder how it would look all black. Everything, the rims, everything, tinted windows. I wonder how this car would look like that. I just, it was a thought, okay? So, I'm driving and I say, well, show me something cool, universe. And I go over a hill and I stop at the red line. There's a car in front of me. And it's a... Tesla Model X. The one that I was looking at saying, wow, I think that would look cool, you know? And it it, it, and it was all in black. It had, the tail was up, um, black rims, tinted window. It was amazing. I was like, wow. A few days ago, I was thinking, you know, looking, just looking, just looking. And I wonder how, what, I wonder what it would look that color. And it's just amazing how the universe always delivers. This happened uh, around six years ago. Let me tell you something that happened. So I'm listening to a song on my iPad. And it's an amazing song. And I'm like, wow, I like this song. And the song is done. And I'm like, oh, well, who sung this song? Oh, my God, who sung this song? It was like, I couldn't get the name of it. No way. I asked Google. Google didn't know what language I was speaking when I was trying to sing. <laughs> so, okay. I forgot all about it. All right? So, I go to New Jersey 10 days later. I have a business deal. And I'm up there. Business goes well, perfect. Make a ton of money. So, I tell myself, I'm going to buy me. The car that I uh, that I always wanted, and that was a Jaguar Model X. I wanted that a Type X, I think it's called, and I didn't know what kind of piece of junks they were. But I go to the dealership and I test drive it, and after like two minutes, I knew right away, no way am I buying this piece of junk. <laughs> no way, okay. So I say, forget, it, I'm leaving. I'm in my Jeep, okay. So let me tell you something about that Jeep. When I was car shopping, okay, because I went homeless. I was homeless and I lost everything. Everything I had, okay, was like, and whatever I had left was all stolen from me, okay. And even my clothes. So it was, but I, I'm, I'm believe me, I'm always going to find a way. I always bounce right back up. That's how I am, no matter what. So... I, I was at dealership and I was like, should I buy the Jeep? I needed the Jeep because it had a lot of room or should I get that Benz? I wanted a Mercedes Benz, but I didn't get it. it was, and good thing I didn't. It was a, um, uh, a S, S500, something like that. The, the worst year, worst piece of junk ever made by Benz. So no way. Good thing I didn't get it. So, okay, now let's go back to the future. So I decided I'm going to buy me that, yeah, what? The, no, it was a piece of junk. So I said, I'm going home. Forget it. I'll go back to Alabama. When I was leaving, I take a wrong turn. How did that happen? Hmm. The universe makes everything happen. And there's a dealership right there. And they have beautiful Mercedes and stuff. And I'm like, well, let me stop and see what's up. And I stop. And he said, that one just came in. Beautiful. It was a C class, formatic. I mean, it looked like it just came out of the factory. Okay. And uh, as, as I said, let's spin. Let's take it for a spin drive. So I get in the car and we go out. As let me tell you, as soon as I pull out of the dry, out of the dealership, I already knew I was going to buy it. I said, I'm, I'm, "This is I'm going back to Bama on this." So I go in. I say, "I like the car. I like the way it drives." You say you want ten grand. Mm -hmm. Car had like 90,000 miles. 
10,000. And it wasn't that old at all when I bought it. You know, compared to the years, it wasn't. And I said, I'll give you 95 cash right now. He said, yeah. I bought the car. I got it for 95. Okay. And I get back to the other part of New Jersey where I was going to. And I park. I'm checking the whole car. I'm checking the buttons, you know. Never had a, a car so fancy like that before. It was like a dream come true. I'm like, wow, I finally got a Benz, you know. Um, so I look in the glove compartment. There's a box. And I say, oh, look, it has a CD changer. Wow, they still make these. Like, well, okay, cool, <laughs> you know. And there's a CD in there. And there's someone burned and put in there. So I hit, let me hit play. What kind of music they were listening to? And guess what it was? It was the song that I was looking for 10 days before that. And it was a song by Elton John. And it's, uh, comes, I forgot the name already, but I have it in my playlist. It's okay. <laughs> but it just shows you how the universe gave me two manifestations at one time because I knew that I was looking at a Mercedes Benz, okay, like a year and a half before that. But I bought a Jeep because I needed the room. A Grand Cherokee fully loaded, limited edition. But I knew that my heart, I, I, it's, not a, it's not in that type of car. It's just not. Just like I don't like Hondas and Toyota, but they are amazing cars. But I do not like them. I don't like Chevys. You ain't going to see me driving a Chevy. I don't like, uh, what are, what are the cars I don't like? Um... Uh, I don't like BMWs. Oh, no. You know, catch me. I don't like the smell in a BMW. I don't. Okay? I'm very picky. American cars, Ford. Dodge, well, I have a Dodge Neon. You know, it's, it is what it is. It was from my dealership before it all collapsed because of my divorce um, years ago. But it, 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 it happens, it happens. The universe works in mysterious ways. That's how it is. You keep manifesting. You keep living in the end result. People... Let me tell you something. The, the Mercedes-Benz manifestation, I was in the dealership. I almost bought an S-Class. It would have been the huge mistake, but the universe said no. Got the Jeep, but the universe know that I wanted that, that I wanted a Benz. So the universe said, you know something? I'm going to give you a Benz, but I'm going to give you this song because you're going to be looking for that song 10 days before, and, I'm gonna, and you can go to New York, and you're going to make a ton of money, and boom, 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 and this is what you're going to get. I'm putting that Benz for you, Papa. No problem. Boom, and just like that. That's how the universe works. See it, feel it, let it go. Let it go. When I was looking for the song from by Elton John, I was on Google. I was trying to sing it and everything. And Google was like, what? <laughs> so I'm trying to tell you, you know, it will come. Everything comes true. Have patience. It comes true. All right. Thanks for watching. It's Mikel. Subscribe.